In this video, I will show you how to fix if your deleted emails keep coming back. So if you're trying to delete emails from your iPhone mail and they keep reappearing, there's a couple of things you can do to fix this problem. Now, the first thing you're gonna to want to try is actually go in into your settings. So you wanna open up the settings app on your device and then you wanna scroll down until you see mail just down here. Go ahead and press onto mail. Then what you need to do is press onto accounts and then select the account that you're having this problem for. So for example, if it's your Outlook that's connected to your mail, you wanna press onto Outlook. And then from here, you wanna come down and press onto account settings and then go ahead and press onto advanced settings. Now from here, you wanna make sure at the top where it says move discarded messages, you wanna make sure that deleted mailbox is selected. Once that's done, you can come out of your settings, restart your device and see if that fixes the problem. Now, if that didn't work for you, another thing you can try is offloading the mail app. So to do that, open up the settings again on your device. This time, what you wanna do is come down to general, just down here, press onto general. Then you wanna press onto iPhone storage. And from here, you just wanna give it a minute and then locate your mail app or Gmail, whichever one it is you're having a problem for. So let's press onto Gmail and you're gonna see an option to offload app. So if you press onto offload app, what it's gonna do is uninstall this app from your device. And all you would do is reinstall it onto your device and that should fix this problem. So that's how to fix if deleted emails keep coming back. With that being said, I hope this quick tutorial did help you out today. And if this did help you out, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.